Annyeonghaseyo! Welcome back to my channel again. In today's video, I will be showing you the easiest way how to prepare Korean kimchi. Okay, uh, stay tuned guys. Ito yung mga ingredients na kakailanganin natin sa ating recipe for today. We have uh, napa cabbage, apples, fish sauce or patties. We have here also garlic, ginger, red chili pepper flakes, salt, glutinous rice flour. We need to slice our napa cabbage into half. like that ilalagay ngayon natin ang ating 4 cups of water sa ating mixing bowl just like that then we need 1 cup of salt and after that Make sure to it na haluin natin ng maigi until the salt is totally dissolved. We need to slice the bottom part of our napa cabbage. Para sa ganon, mailigay natin isa-isa sa ating mixing bowl. So after natin mailagay isa-isa ang ating napa garbage sa ating mixing bowl, kailangan natin haluin ng mabuti. And after that, we need to set aside and leave it there for an hour. We need 2 cups of water. We need also half cup of glutinous rice flour. And I forgot to mention a while ago, na dapat nakalohit lang siya. And now we need to stir it up until maluto siya or when it gets thick. Ayan guys, luto na siya. And we need to transfer it in the bowl. And then... We need to set aside and let it cool down. So after one hour, kailangan natin balikan ng ating napagabage at kailangan natin balik terin para sa ganun maging even siya. And after that, we need to leave there again for another 30 minutes. After cooling down, our glutinous rice flour we can prepare now our kimchi paste fish sauce or patties garlic apples Ginger Red chili pepper flakes Glutinous rice flour So tatakpan na natin siya guys Para mag-blend siya So after 1.5 hours in total na nakababad ang ating 
napa garbage sa ating mixing bowl with the water and salt we can now rinse our veggies just like that guys so ito na guys yung kimchi paste natin so after natin mabanlawan ang ating napag cabbage ilalagay na natin sa ating container just like that ilalagay natin yun kimchi paste natin So make sure to it guys na malagyan ng uh, filling itong uh, uh, garbage natin, itong napa garbage. So ayan guys, tapos na siya. Yeah, we need to close the lid and we need to leave it here overnight or 24 hours for fermentation kaya babalikan natin siya bukas guys the next day ito na ang ating korean kimchi I don't know if you can hear it guys na ano siya tawag ito crispy sarap siya mm. so pwede na natin ngayon guys ilagay sa fridge ang ating korean kimchi ayan Hope you enjoyed watching this video. Thank you for watching again. Till next time, guys.